Hello guys and welcome back for another tutorial. As you can see I have here Premiere here opening and my Premiere is in English. Uh, I know a lot of people has been teaching uh, through the internet how to change the language of the software but uh, as, I, as far as I saw everyone's showing you or most of the people are showing you how to do this in a dodgy way which is, an, is not a good thing especially if you have the original uh, license. So the, I'll say the official way to do it is coming here on the CC app and within the CC app which is here you go on the wheel and you go for the preferences and inside preferences you go for creative cloud and here you can change the language for the whole application but the thing is once you do this you're going to change the application for every single Adobe software and I'll say if you work in Europe for example which you have like a multi-culture and people from all around Europe converges and people just go everywhere and like sometimes you have more than one person um, working on the same computer and though these people are from uh, different countries so maybe you want like one software in one language and another software in another language and I'm going to show you how to do this quite easily with Premiere and it's awesome as you can see and it just takes like one second literally like I'll say yeah one second so my application language I'm going to keep it as English so I won't I won't change that and my Premiere which is here you will see it's uh, also in English so yeah every single uh, menu item is in English to do that you're going to use a hidden feature within Premiere within Premiere so within Premiere you cannot find this on, on any menu so on the Macintosh you need to go for command and F12 and you open the console the console is some place where you can Oh damn! You can type like for things. So you have like yeah, you have parameters here. But like you can also do them from the debug database view. That's the thing. And that's the main uh, trick. So here I have application language, and that's where I'm gonna change the language. So for example, I'm from Brazil, and if you do this here and change for PTBR, and you just close Premiere. And once you open it again, I can even open from here, from the Creative Cloud. So I'm going to open Premiere Pro. And once you open Premiere, you can check it's already in Portuguese. Simple as that. And the cool thing as well is like all the menus are going to be in Portuguese and also you're going to have between quotes here, you're going to have the, the English version. So you can work on, on the same software uh, for people from different backgrounds and who speak different languages have different preferences so probably this is happening because my application language is English but my software language now is in Portuguese so it just optimizes in a way and like every menu now is like bilingual and um, probably to do this bilingual stuff here I'm gonna show you as soon as it opens and as you can see like the menu changes here as well so it's different configuration and everything here as you can see is like bilingual and the trick about it being bilingual is also on the console you have the option to make it bilingual so as you can see here my here is bilingual so you leave you change this from false which is the original one you change to true and once this is true you're gonna have a bilingual software if you don't want this to have like the double thing you just leave as false and you're gonna be fine so yeah this is original there's nothing bad about that you won't be uh, breaking your license you won't be um, hacking anything it's just uh, a simple way to do something with people people's been struggling for yeah quite a long time so thank you very much for watching and see you next time